Okay, so today is the gloomiest day I think I've ever seen. <laughs> um, it is so bad. It's like wet and rainy and gray outside. And I feel... <clears throat> um, so I'm gonna do like some plant care or something. Just to make myself feel better, have a coffee, do some cleaning. Just like try to relax, do stuff that is kind of therapeutic. Um, yeah, because this weather, this month, even like January, February. Can we can we skip over these months, please, and just like get into spring? That would be great. Yes, I know there's Valentine's Day this month, but I'm not feeling the love. So <laughs> I'm just kidding. Not completely, but um, yeah, I'm gonna do some plant care and just kind of do like a vlog of me doing plant care talking about stuff, maybe asking some opinions because I'm always redecorating and I'm trying to figure out like where to put all my plants. Um, there's a lot less than there was at this time last year, but I'm happy with the plants that I have. I haven't bought any new ones this year, so I think now I'm just gonna, yeah, just do some plant care and kind of figure out, maybe try to plan what I want to do. I know I want to do like a plant wall with like baskets over my TV. So maybe I'll try to do a little bit of that now since I have a few baskets, but we'll see, we'll get into it. I'm gonna make my coffee first though, so. And also wait for my phone to charge a little bit because it's dead and I feel dead. Hi, you just chilling? You like this weather? I hate it. I hate it. Okay, so I'm just gonna make an iced coffee. Um, my favorite thing to do, I'm like carrying my charger around with me because I didn't plan this. I just kind of went for it. You know, the sad just kicked in and I was like, okay, I'm gonna do stuff and try to, try to snap out of it. So I'm making an iced coffee. Um, it's a little messy, so I'm gonna like do that, do some plant care. Um, I'm gonna shower my plants so while they're like sitting in the shower, I'm gonna clean up my kitchen a little bit. Repping the Montreal hoodie. I got this the first time my friends and I went to Montreal. And I mean, I live in Ottawa. I should probably go more because it's so close. And also because I love Montreal, it's beautiful. Um, but je ne parle pas beaucoup français. Can we'll you for a straw? I need an organizer. I don't have an organizer for my drawer because it's like such a small drawer. So I just have black coffee that I made. Um, this is what I use just to make my coffee. It's a groche. Is that how you say it? This is what I use. It's just like a stovetop coffee machine. But I'm thinking of investing in a nice one. I just I don't really want to use one with the pods because I don't want to waste. Um, every time I make coffee, I prefer just to buy the grounds. It lasts pretty long and it's less waste. So I just put brown sugar in there. And then I'm gonna see if I have ice. I actually think I have to make ice. Okay, I do have ice actually. I have this cute little honeycomb ice maker. I'm just gonna like throw some ice in there. Then pour in my coffee. That's like the first time I've poured coffee and not spilled it. I just have some like creamer, the almond creamer. I like this one a lot. Honestly, I usually just use milk. Like I like to buy the oat milk without sugar, but I was craving this recently. So I bought like a big jar of it. I like my coffee pretty creamy. <laughs> it's gotta be like a nice. All right, I think that's enough. Coffee. 
is made. Mmm, that makes me happy. Let's go do some plant care. Okay, so as you can see, my plants are in a lot of need of some water. I actually watered this guy already, but I didn't water the pool. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put all of my larger plants and the ones with holes into the shower and just let them soak and shower down a little bit. So I have that guy and then I think these ones I'll throw in there as well. You wanna come inside? <laughs> and then this here is just my plant shelf. Um, my monster needs watering for sure. Look at her, she's so sad. Um, I'm gonna throw a lot of these in the shower too, just shower them down and give them a good watering. But yeah, most of them are not happy with this weather either. I haven't been using my grow lights, so that could be why too. Okay, so what I'm doing is I literally just fill up my tub with my plants in their nursery pots. So I take them out. This one needs repotting. I think we're gonna do that actually today. Um, but I'm gonna just water it for now too. My silver sword is not growing very well. I don't know if you can see that. If you have any tips, let me know. I feel like maybe she's not getting enough humidity or enough water, or I don't know, like the, the leaves are not coming out very big and they're coming out kind of crunkled, crinkled. I don't know what I was doing. I don't know what's going on with it, but I'm gonna water her now. This plant though, my Mykins, glorious. She's glorious. She's living her best fucking life. Look at her. So pretty, favorite plant. Makes me feel proud as a plant parent despite all of my other failures. <laughs> so I'm gonna throw her in there too, give her a good wash down because um, I have her on a pole. All right, and then these two, these are the last ones I'll put in. Fit them in there somewhere. All right. Then what I like to do, I like to plug up the bathtub so no soil gets down, um, but also so that they can soak a little bit. I put in the plug, and then I'm just gonna put on the shower to like a cold. Okay, once I've given them their initial shower down and I have like some water sitting at the bottom, I'm gonna give them a little bit of a nutrient boost too. So I'm gonna use Kelpie. I like to just mix this with some water as well as the yucca extract from Bios Nutrients. I don't know if we can read that. It's a natural insecticide, keeps soil most hydrated and makes foliar sprays much more effective. Um, I'm gonna use that as well, just because I have it. So I'm just going to pour a little bit in the watering can. You could probably just add like a few drops to the water too and kind of swish it around because that way they can like soak it up from the bottom. I didn't think about that until right now. <laughs> We'll go ahead and do it this way. I'm gonna make sure all that moss gets nice and wet. Alright. So I'm gonna let that soak there and I'm gonna do some dishes and we'll come back. <clears throat> and I can't speak. We'll come back and we'll do some other plant care. Hi! So I ended up cleaning up my kitchen. We're gonna do some plant care again, but first we're gonna walk this little boy. You wanna go for a walk? <laughs> yes, you do. Mwah. 
<laughs> okay. I really want to get a bench for my entryway and like a nice rug. That's something I'm working towards. <laughs> So now I'm just gonna. Oh. First of all, we some kitty cuddles. Now I'm just gonna water the rest of the plants Ooh. that are on my shelf, and then I'm gonna like repot some stuff. So I'm gonna first of all re just water this stuff. Here. Oh my god, I just. selling this shelf like I don't know it's kind of big and awkward and I really want to get a nice bookshelf and kind of make my apartment a little more practical I kind of want to change like from having a plant collection to just using plants as decor um, yeah I just want to get a bookshelf instead and you know I'm thinking of getting a keyboard like a piano so I kind of need room for that do. This plant is not doing well at all. I do not know. And this one too. Oh my lord. Hey! Hi, Papa! Little stinky cat. too much but I'm sure she'll bounce right back um, I'm actually gonna take it off of the pole because I do want some more trailing plants she looked really good on the pole when I actually had her up like right now she's just a mess but I'm sure we'll work something out so I don't even know if this pot is any bigger if it's just more shallow because you can see Those are roots on there. Crazy. Uh, so I do want to give her some. Oh, a lot of the roots are actually not great because they've been sitting in water, I guess. So I'm probably going to actually have to cut some roots off. Um, I'm making a mess. I'm just going to make a mess. Okay, so I'm going to take this out. Oh, I really stuck it in there. Oh my god. That's probably why there's less room to grow. Yeah, I think this one is a little bit bigger, for sure. So I'm just going to get some of my chunky soil mix. Try to throw it in there. That's mostly... And basically just pulling this out. You can really get it through the holes. Just kind of work it in. Yeah, I like that. 
gonna have to pick off a lot of <laughs> a lot of leaves. Jeez, oh man. It was really nice before. I let it dry out way too much. Man. she did before but now that should be fine now just gonna clean that up a bit shower her down and then try to like make sure her all the leaves are trailing I might snip a few off and propagate and then make the plant a little fuller after so let's yeah let's clean up first and then we'll see if we can make a trail and then I might hang some stuff on my wall above my TV so let's see okay so it kind of looks like crap now but she's replanted. I'm gonna wait for the soil to dry out a little bit more and for the leaves to come back. Uh, so maybe tomorrow I'll try propagating a little bit and uh, hanging it on my wall. But for now, let's try to put some baskets on my wall and try to see if we can figure out like a design. Cause I wanna do like a basket wall. So excuse the mess, cause yeah, it's, it's a mess. But I wanna do like a basket wall kind of above the TV here and put plants. Like maybe some baskets without plants, but like I want to do like a kind of wicker look with plants. And then this corner here is going to be my bar corner. It's obviously not together yet. I'm going to put two uh, wine racks there and then put like some cute photos here. Keep some other alcohol in there and stuff. Just have a cute little bar corner. You know, I thought it would look cute. Especially with my wine racks. I love my wine. Okay, so technically I'm not supposed to put nails in my walls, but I feel like I'm gonna be here a little while and if I leave, I can just fix it myself. Like it's not that hard, right? Um, so I'm gonna actually remove this and replace this with a nail because it's a little bulky and I don't really want that. So I'm gonna do that and then try to figure out an arrangement or something Okay, so these here are the baskets that I'll be using to hang on the wall. So I'm gonna have to like figure out an arrangement for them. Just Try to figure out like do larger and smaller. Um, hmm. Maybe I could like somehow tape them to the wall with just like some painter's tape without any plants or anything in them just to see what they look like on the wall before I like commit to putting a nail on the wall because that would suck. So I think that's what I'm going to do now.
So this is what I ended up doing for now. Um, I'm not sure how I'm feeling about it. I think I have to wait until it's like daytime to see if I actually like it or not. So I'm not gonna put anything else on the wall for now. Just kind of see what this looks like in the morning once the plants are actually refreshed and stuff and clean up the mess that I made. So I'll be back in the morning to show you what it looks like. So it's morning, it's kind of gloomy, but I'm kind of loving how it looks. I'm, I feel like it's, I need to put more or do something else. But for now, I'm just leaving it like that until I can get up my, uh, my wine racks here. I have them here already. I just don't know how to use a drill and I don't have a drill. So I'm gonna be putting them into the wall. I'm not supposed to, cause I'm renting, but I think I'll be here a little while. So <laughs> I'm gonna do what I want. <laughs> Don't tell anybody. But yeah, this is what it looks like. I think it looks cute. Your opinion. You think it looks cute? Give me puff. Give me puff, it looks cute. Uh, he doesn't think it looks cute. Well, I do, so. Fuck what you think. Fuck what you think. <laughs> Are you my baby? Hi, baby. <laughs> Excuse the mess, I just have a bunch of stuff there. And this plant is doing pretty good now. It's my Cebu Blue. I'm letting her trail now instead, so maybe we can just kind of sort it out a little bit. It's kind of like stuck in here. I don't know, I'm gonna have to do that with two hands. <laughs> but I love the little wicker. 